Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Zane. Let's have a look at NEAR protocol. What exactly is NEAR? NEAR is a smart contract capable blockchain that is designed to be a next generation platform for dApps with its own unique scaling solution. Now, before we continue with this video, allow me to declare that this video is not financial advice. It's strictly for entertainment purposes and for educational purposes. Now, we have a lot of things to go through in this video, a lot of exciting things to go through within this video. I will explain to everyone what NEAR protocol is, what they do and how they work. We will also have a look at the token and the price of the token. We will go through a token analysis and price prediction, which should be really fun. NEAR protocol. What exactly is NEAR protocol? How does it work? It's a decentralized development platform that is designed to provide the ideal environment for dApps by overcoming some of the limitations of competing systems such as low throughput, low speeds and poor cross compatibility. It operates on top of the NEAR protocol as a developer friendly proof of stake blockchain that incorporates a number of innovations to boost scalability and reduce costs for developers and end users. Its innovation includes a unique take on sharding and a powerful new consensus mechanism known as Doomslug. Now it is being built by the NEAR Collective, a worldwide community of researchers, developers and thinkers who wrote the initial code for the NEAR protocol and continue to support the project by releasing bug fixes, updates and building out the surrounding NEAR ecosystem. So since the code for NEAR is open source, anybody can join the collectible and began contributing towards its development. So how does this protocol work? This is really important to understand today. Similar to Ethereum, Cardano or Tron, NEAR can, be described, NEAR can be described as a base layer blockchain, which means its foundation is built upon other applications, which means that its foundation upon which other blockchains are built and deployed. NEAR uses a technology known as Nightshade to achieve its massive throughput capabilities. The scaling solution sees individual sets of validators process transactions and parallel across multiple sharded chains to improve the overall transactions carrying capacity of the blockchain. This solution differs somewhat from the sharding system used by other blockchains in that each shard produces a fraction of the next block known as a chunk. These are processed and immutably stored on the near blockchain to finalize transactions contained within. But what makes it so special? What makes NEAR protocol so special? Well, it's designed to be a next generation platform for dApps. Now to achieve this, it tackles some of the largest standing issues in the blockchain space, as well as that as it only becomes apparent relatively recently. For one, NEAR is incredibly fast. It's able to process somewhere in the orders of 100,000 transactions per second and achieve transaction finality near instantly thanks to a one second block cadence. Cadence. According to NEAR, its technology means it can achieve transaction fees that are 10,000 X lower than they are on Ethereum. How revolutionary is this? Because you have to think about how much it costs to use Ethereum compared to how much it costs to use NEAR protocol. It will be much cheaper, which means that a lot more people will prefer to use NEAR if it's ease of use. This essentially makes them essentially negligible. Here's another additional question. Who exactly is building on NEAR? Despite launching its mainnet less than a year ago, there are a large number of projects already building on the platform. Some of these include Flux, a decentralized open market protocol that launched on NEAR in August 2020. There's also Mintbase, a platform that makes issuing and selling NFTs simple and cheap. And additionally, there's Paris, an NFT marketplace that focus on high quality work created by selected artists. Now this is absolutely fantastic because the NEAR Foundation is currently operating the NEAR Grant NGP which supports projects that help to grow the NEAR ecosystem and its community. A total of 1 million worth of grants will be awarded in H1. Now it's actually time to have a look at the token, the NEAR protocol token itself. This is really fascinating. Now the utility token is known as NEAR, N-E-A-R. It's a token that's used for incentivizing nodes on the NEAR network and it's also used for powering transactions and the numerous NEAR smart contracts. Now as a community governed platform, NEAR token holders can participate in the on-chain governance of NEAR platform or they can have a validator vote on their behalf. 
So this is fantastic. Now the price is currently $17.94 and it's fluctuating as we speak. In the last 24 hours, it's risen above 16% within price, market cap and volume. Now that's fantastic, but remember, this token has a huge circling supply, 607 million right now to be exact. That's in circling supply and max supply is 1 billion. Now in the long term, this doesn't matter. We don't care about circling supply. And we don't care about max supply as long as there can't be any more supplies minted. That's all we really care about. But it does have a huge supply, which means that the token price will stay relatively low. Ultimately, this is probably a good thing because it's easier for a lot of people to buy a token that is cheaper rather than one that's more expensive. Interestingly, the token is actually ranked number 19th in the world by all cryptocurrencies by market cap. By the way, that's a market cap of 10.8%. Billion. That's incredible. So the question is, can this market cap double? Can the price double? What can we expect to see this year? So this is what I'll include in my price analysis today. The good news is that the token has been doing really well within the last 24 hours. In fact, within the last few hours in itself, within the last six hours, to give or take, it's been consolidating, but it's also been going up in an upward trend, which is great. This is previous to the early hours of this given 24 hours where it was consolidating heavily. But since then, it's made a huge jump in price, which is brilliant. It went from around $16 per coin to where it is right now. In fact, it was actually higher at around $18 per coin. This is really significant, include increase in its cost by $2 per coin. Now, looking at this token within the last seven days, you can obviously see that this token has had a rough time. Because the crypto market has been falling, the market has been feeling extremely bearish. You have to understand that overall, there is a there is a downward trend at the moment. So very few cryptos are actually able to beat the market and turn around to actually go against the market to do the complete opposite. And this is exactly what Nair Protocol has been doing for the last couple of days. Since around the 10th of January, since around the 10th of January, the price has actually gone from $13 per coin to where it is right now, over $18 per coin. Well, it's actually $17.84 per coin, but you get my point. So you can obviously see that there was a strong resistance around $13 per coin, a really strong resistance. That is good. This tells us that if we do experience another crash in the next few months, this coin has a strong resistance around $13. There are other resistance as well, considering that it was consolidating in the last 24 hours around $15 and $16 per coin. But at some of its lowest marks, around $13, really, really strong consolidation. Some really, really strong resistance because if you go back even further towards the end of December, you'll see the same trend. Once again, around the 28th of December, there was strong resistance as well, around $13 per coin. So you can clearly see that a realistic price is above $13. This is good because if in the case of a crash, we, we want to have a good idea of where this crypto could go, how far it could fall, how much volume it could lose. And because it has a strong resistance around $13, we shouldn't really see this crypto being falling to around $5. That would be insanity. It would be too undervalued. It would just be insane. It would not stay that low for long. Give or take even $10. Even $10 would be an absolute surprise because the last time it was actually at $10, was around the 22nd of December. But I have a feeling those days are going away quite soon because people are starting to realize that there's just more value within this crypto than they've ever realized. The last time this crypto was anywhere near $5, it was $6.80. And this was on the 6th of December. But you know, what's even more exciting is that the 24 hours trading volumes are huge on this crypto. 1.6 billion within the last 24 hours have been traded on this crypto. 1.6, almost 1.7 billion. That's US dollars, by the way. This is a long way from where it started one year ago. It was $1.60 one year ago, to be exact. Now it's $17.82. This just goes to show that the token circulating supply, even when it has a huge and large supply, shouldn't always dictate in your mindset how much this token could risen in the future. In fact, you should use it as a way to learn more about the token and why it could beat the market ads. So given where it is right now, of how strong the trading volume is, of how strong the resistance are, I'm predicting that this token can at least double this year. This is doubling within market cap. That's quite insane by the sounds of it. 
but we have seen crazier things happen. Consider where the market is right now. The market is still in a downward trend. Even Bitcoin, Ethereum, the leading ones in the market, they're still in a downward trend. This includes Solana, Cordana, XRP, Terra, Polkadot, Avalanche, even Binance Coin. They're all in a downward trend. Near Protocol is actually recovering and it's recovering really, really nicely. This is a good sign. If it can do this when the market is down, imagine what the price of this token will be when the market is on its next bull run. Imagine that. That's going to be insane. I'm telling you, price will double this year. I would be surprised if the price doesn't triple this year. We're talking 2x or 3x this year for Near Protocol. I think the $50 mark is definitely a long way off. It's definitely in the question for the next couple of years. I'll give it one to two years to achieve $50. It's definitely not impossible by any chance. If this crypto was the 3x, it would actually be around $50. Just think about that, which means that the market cap would be around $32 billion, approximately $32 billion US dollars in market cap. That doesn't sound unrealistic, does it? Honestly, we should be looking at this coin to 6x. That's honestly, realistically, what we should be looking at is 6x for Near Protocol. Can Near Protocol achieve over 60 billion in market cap? And very few coins have actually crossed the 60 billion market cap range. Very few. In fact, only four has done this. So for, for Near Protocol to do this, it would be quite unrealistic to assume that near protocol could actually do this but i definitely think that around but i definitely think that around 20 to 30 billion is definitely in the question for this year so, so 2 to 3x is definitely within the question this year which means that we could be seeing near protocol achieving 50 dollars this year it's definitely possible so i hope you've enjoyed this video thank you for watching until the end i really appreciate that we do have a discord and the link is in the description below you can also follow us on Twitter, subscribe, and if you have any questions or if I missed anything in this video, please leave a comment and let's have a discussion. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.